Stephen Burnett was an early convert to the Mormon Church. In 1838, after hearing Book of Mormon witness Martin Harris speak and say that he did not physically see and handle the gold plates, Burnett decided to leave Mormonism. In April 1838, Burnett wrote a letter to Mormon Apostle Lyman Johnson, explaining his reason for leaving the church. The letter said, When I came to hear Martin Harris state in a public congregation that he never saw the plates with his natural eyes, only in vision or imagination, neither Oliver nor David, and also that the eight witnesses never saw them, and hesitated to sign that instrument for that reason, but were persuaded to do it. The last pedestal gave way. In my view, our foundation was sapped, and the entire superstructure fell in heap of ruins. I therefore, three weeks since in the stone chapel, gave a full history of the church since I became acquainted with it. The false preaching and prophesying of Joseph, together with the reasons why I took the course which I was resolved to do, and renounced the Book of Mormon. After we were done speaking, Martin Harris arose and said he was sorry for any man who rejected the Book of Mormon, for he knew it was true. He said he had hefted the plates repeatedly in a box, with only a tablecloth or a handkerchief over them, but he never saw them, only as he saw a city through a mountain, and said that he never should have told that the testimony of the eight witnesses was false if it had not been picked out of him, but should have let it pass as it was. I am well satisfied for myself that if the witnesses whose names are attached to the Book of Mormon never saw the plates as Martin admits, that there can be nothing brought to prove that any such thing ever existed.